Michael, you are going to have to stop making videos so that I no longer feel compelled to have to respond to them. This is the fourth one in a row. I, like you, would like my life back. Hang on. I don't have one. Ah, okay. Forget what I just said. This is in response to your latest video where you claim that you are a nerd by showing us your science fiction DVD collection and your little plastic R2. Michael, your nerdiness is insignificant next to the power of my nerdiness. Do you see what I mean? I'm quoting Star Wars in everyday speech. Huh? Anyway, I just thought I would share with you my nerdy DVD collection, which goes way above and beyond your nerdy DVD collection. Oh yes, believe me, it does. Now, uh, we're in the living room again. As you can hear, the audio is kind of changing to a, a vast echoey chamber. <laughs> Um, we'll pan around. No. Uh, which has, as you can see, virtually no storage space, which was one of the reasons why I bought this um, coffee table and that sort of, I guess, kind of a TV video unit. Um, because the drawers in these um, videos. Yeah, you didn't see that. Um, the drawers in these. Uh, tables are ideally suited for storing uh, CDs and because I don't use this as a TV or video unit because the TV and video are over there uh, I keep CDs in this one that's on my Gary Newman CDs uh, actually that's them up to there and there's the singles are in there <laughs> um, but because I have no place to keep my DVDs and in the last house there was these sort of built in, um, they were like, they're called presses, uh, like a little pantry built into each room. Uh, and we'd taken the door off one and made it into like a little bookcase and had all these nice old volumes, um, which kind of suited the room because it was like an old cottage. And I didn't really like the idea of having um, all these myriad variety of, uh, hang on, that's not right, that's bad grammar, isn't it? Myriad variety. Of this myriad of multicolored um, spines. Um, spoiling the, inter <laughs> the interior decor, <laughs> the colour scheme. <laughs> Getting sadder and sadder as the video progresses. So I thought, um, well, since I have plenty CD storage, um, that it would be an idea to take the DVDs, seeing as how they are of the same shape and size as a CD, and put them in CD cases and store them thusly. But, um, obviously, we don't have CD shaped labels, so I came up with a little um, label design, a plain white label design that I was able to, to print off labels with the name of the DVD on it and have stored them because it would be almost impossible to find them because all the labels are identical alphabetically. Oh, yes, we are getting more and more anally retentive. I know. So, here we go. Top drawer, we begin with the A's. Uh, in this case, it's actually uh, one about someone building a Land Rover. <laughs> um, and then we get into the, the regular stuff, the movies. Um, there we go. Alien Quadrilogy. Uh, you'll see these ones that are, are, are handwritten. Um, that's because uh, after the separation, um, she got the printer. Uh, <laughs> and I haven't actually bought one yet, because basically this is the only thing I ever used it for. Um, so, uh, a few of them, uh, yeah, yes I know, Bad Boys and Bad Boys too, but it was only a fiver for the box set, so I thought, well, what the hell. Um, Battlestar Galactica, absolutely fantastic, and we're working my way through Series 2 at the moment. Um, yes, we've got all the Blades. Blade Runner, one of the best films ever made. Um, and I'm looking forward to the director's cut of that one. Uh, now, th of course, the really annoying thing is, is, like, for example, when I bought A League of Their Own, which went, you know, goes up here. Now each the, these these trays, I mean, they're, they're, they fit exactly. So when I put one in here, it knocks one out of there. So I have to take that out and put it down here, and that then knocks one out of the top there, which I then have to relocate to the front of this one. Which, yes, as you can tell, um, it's fine if I buy something that begins with T or S, uh, which is usually in the last two drawers. But if I, if I buy something that begins with A. 
I have to redo the whole <laughs> the whole uh, arrangement. And we are actually into overspill. Um, we're, we, we've got W here and my Zs. I've had to come over here uh, into this, this part. Oh, God. there we go. Um, my Zoolander. Uh, what have we got? Zoolander. Well, oh, Young Frankenstein. Wonderful, funny movie. Terry Gar. Gorgeous, gorgeous woman. Uh huh. So, yes, um, in addition to your collection, you'll find that I have something very, very similar in that there they are. Some of the best films ever made, The Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring, extended version, in brackets, two discs, and yes, these are little two-disc um, CD cases, so both, both discs are in there, and of course, the appendices. Uh, now, what's really annoying is when things like this happen, and they get split up. <laughs> Uh, I want them all together. But yeah, I must admit the boxes that they came in looked rather nice, but some of the other ones are kind of sort of, you know, I don't mind them being in here like the Matrixes. Um, what else have we got? Well, the really important ones, here they are. There we go. Phantom Menace, Tack the Clones, Revenge of the Sith, The New Hope, Empire Strikes Back, and Return of the Jedi. Yay! Again, all two disc sets, apart from these ones. So I just lied there. And of course, when it comes to something that begins with a number, like 12 Angry Men or 2001, um, I of course take the, um, the, the Wordle equivalent. <laughs> yes, I just made that up because I can't think of the, the correct term. Um, obviously 12 and 2 begin with a T and a W, so that would obviously come between TR and the U. <laughs> Taking sadness to a whole new level. So that's my DVD collection and how I store it and where I keep it. Uh, <laughs> um, but you know what? It works and it keeps the room nice and sort of clear of clutter. I mean, yes, I know I said I didn't like the thing about the spines and yes, that's exactly what we have here, but um, DVDs didn't fit in here and uh, uh, I can put up with that because they're, they're not too bad. So there you go. That's my little DVD collection. Um, Nerds of the world unite. Bye bye the new. Oh, and one other thing, Michael. Ta -da! Oh.